Today starts off with some good reselling news of my bins items that I purchased yesterday, which I think was a total of five. Three of them sold already. $20, $20, $38. That's with free shipping, so my profits will be a little bit lower, but not bad off of a $12 investment. In the world of supplies, things are getting pretty darn low for packaging stuff, so I might actually have to buy some things. These fuel bottles have been selling, as you can see. They were all the way to the front, and... They take up a lot of resources. So far, the only interior packing item that I've gotten is this bubble wrap. This is my second roll of this, and they start out pretty darn huge, but I need uh, I need something like this. It's a bummer having to spend money on actual packaging stuff, but, you know, it's a part of the business, so you got to do what you got to do, and uh, I got to package this stuff up and send it out using my newly, freshly organized shipping area over here. Makes life very easy. Also making life easy, my new label printer. Printing labels very nicely and saving me a lot of time. Boom, boom, boom. Here is today's tower. Top four items from the bins. Bottom one, yard sale. Good morning, chickions. Look at you guys out here. Looking all majestic in the sunlight. And mouthy too. Came down here to throw some stuff away. But it looks like I might be getting into some corn too, because I think they have some expectations of me. Speaking of majestic, look at all these flowers. These are leftover wildflowers that I planted last year that I think have just kept growing back. Some of them are perennials. So it's pretty neat. There's also a couple of red ones down here too. I guess these aren't red, they're more pink, but yeah. I just thought, you know, this area between our fences might as well turn it into something. And I think that's just beautiful. All right, I'm coming, I'm coming. No? Oh, yes, yes. No. Clax is the only one that's brave enough. <laughs> She's like, I don't really like it, but I'll tolerate it. They don't call them chickens for nothing. They're chickens. Woody, let me touch you. Okay, here we go. Watch out. <laughs> Who will be brave enough to face the hand? Hey, get out of there. Num, 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 num. Okay. You guys ready? Here we go. And it gets quiet. Oh my goodness for myself. What is your you screaming about? What are you screaming about? <laughs> Everybody's mouthy out here today, huh? Oh. Boys play Pokemon. Men play Monster Train. Toot toot. Toot. Toot toot. I'm doing a run, boys. Let's get it. That's me when I wake up in the morning. That's me back there. I think I'm going to switch to these guys. These little demon creatures. Yeah, I'm gonna go with the Stygian guard. Yeah, 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 yeah. I went to give my kid the water and uh, he disappeared. Oh, he's grittying by the bush. Okay, okay. Just think a week from today, that's gonna be it, my guy. The only way I have is this. And that's all the way into my bag. Oh, Chromebook's gone? Uh -huh. I'm, Just party time like, at this my point. Like, like, it's full of helium. So what are you guys going to be doing for the next week? I don't have no clue. No Chromebooks? Just chilling? Yesterday's attendance time was on paper. So oh, I guess... you guys are using paper again. Mm -hmm. 18th century is returned. <laughs> it's like Beauty and the Beast, Clark, man. Once all the flower petals fall off, the beast is forever a beast. Probably talking about you, actually. The bear is out, and the bear is sniffing. 
Oh, here comes our guy. <laughs> this Clark. Oh my God. Bro's gonna wonder what you're on. He's like, what guys are coming? He's like, how many steps you got on that Fitbit? Sure, sure, sure. A million. I love All right, you. I love you, buddy. You have a great day at school. Let's come on, Rexy Bear. Dang. They got those squeaky brakes today. Another day, another bus. Welcome everyone to Home Alone with Greg and Rexy Bear. Oh goodness. Oh goodness. Today's excitement, going to the dentist to get my teeth cleaned. I have to be there at 8. I mean 9.30. <laughs> Not 8.30. That would have been bad. We are on the road, heading to the dentist, running through yellow lights, just in the nick of time. I think my dentist is up here on the right. I only come here every six months and I've only been here a few times since we've had to switch dentists. My old one retired. So I think it's up here. We'll find it. First time I had a heck of a time locating it. This is the reason why it's like tucked back in here. You can barely even see it. I'm like, it's not this place. It's not this place. Where is this place? This place. I kind of miss my old dentist actually. What I liked most about it was my hygienist lady. I would look at the pictures of her kids every six months I would go in there. And it was crazy to see these kids growing up. Like the first time I went there, she had a couple kids and she was pregnant. And then over time I saw that kid go from like in her belly to like growing up and going to school. It was nuts. So uh, I don't have that here yet, but maybe we can build something, some type of relationship up like that where I can uh, see the uh, passing of time through uh, six month intervals. Five minutes early, just like you should be for every appointment. If you're not early, you're late. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. That feeling when you leave the dentist in your mouth is just absolutely perfection. I love it. Also made some friends in there too. Some older folks live up the road from us. So that was kind of cool. Got to come back December 5th, 10, 15 AM. I can't live this life anymore with the pollen and stuff. So we're going to hit up the car wash over here. See if we can get that all uh, taken care of. Maybe if I'm lucky, it'll get rid of all the bugs that are on the windshield too. Okay. Let's see what this is like. This is way fancier pants than the ones that I usually go to. And we got some options here. $15, $12, $9. You know what? Let's just go with the $9. I just want to get the stuff off here. I don't want to go broke. Oh, they actually got people working in here too. You have to have your car in neutral and it like drives you forward. Get those bugs and fall in. Guess when it's moving this entire time, it allows more cars to go through quickly. But that's pretty cool. I wonder at what point I have to like start driving again. It just, it just kicks me out. Okay, I guess we'll drive. That was pretty cool. Other than the fact that they put your mirrors in and then like my mirrors are still in. Let's take a gander at the job. Yeah, I think I did pretty good. Here's my next objective. TJ Maxx. Clean. Cody needs some Manuka honey, and they have it here, and it's affordable. At least sometimes they have it here, so we're gonna check. Oh, I love these. The Nissan Cube? Yeah. They're cool. Very Japanese-y. That's a word. <laughs> I love it. Most people probably don't, though. I just think they're neat. Okay, DJs, let's go on a hunt. Food stuff is typically over here. Let's see if we can find some Manuka honey. Okay, we're close. There's like raw honey. These are fruit spreads, jams. I don't know what Manuka honey is, but I know if you get it at Wegmans, it's like wicked expensive. Might get lucky down here. Still 12 99 it's still kind of expensive, but that's cool. Maybe I should get a couple of them. How long are these good for? Probably forever. Message Cody and she said, go ahead and grab two. So I grabbed their entire stock, which was these two. Next stop, post office. Full bags become empty bags as we finish our jobs 
out in the wild. Working on becoming a narrator. In fact, I was thinking about switching these whole vlogs up into like a voiceover style. I thought that might be kind of cool and somewhat professional. But then I think maybe you lose the, the personality of them where you're in the moment with me. Cause it'd just be like me showing this and then you'd hear like voiceover Greg be like, yeah, we, we parked at the bank where it's bank parking only to go to the post office. And I walked out with my empty bags. Could be cool. I'll try it, do an experiment one of these days. Home for some lunch. You remember my hot sausage run from last week? This is the remainder of it. There's one left, probably on the tail end of its life, but we're gonna make it uh, disappear today. Roxy's also making food disappear. It's one of her specialties. I just made the video that pretty much everyone needed in their life, only not really, the label printer video. Thought, hey, since I'm doing it, I might as well make a video on it showing what it's like. Not very professional because it was my first time doing this, but I did my best showing it off and showing what it's like to set it up and gave tips and stuff. So hopefully it works. There's lots of extra stuff in here too. It's definitely like a vlog product review setup thing, but that's the kind of content that I like and that's what I like to make. So that's what I did. Double good news. Sold another one of those fuel bottles and I think we've got a thunderstorm rolling in. I love to capture these whenever I can. Pretty cool. They always come in like from this way and I hear a little bit of rumbling. Also hear a lot of chickening. I think it might actually be starting right now. We got a couple drops. Oh yeah. I love thunderstorms. There have been so many good ones lately. They were calling for this today and I thought they were wrong this morning when it was all nice and sunny, but you can see Pennsylvania, it switches over pretty darn quickly. Here it comes. I think that's two days in a row. Really good storms here. And it's getting cold too. Wow. That's really chilly. There's the chickions. They're under their cloth. Now it's getting good. It just keeps getting better and better. Wow. Now we're talking. Special delivery boy too. You know what this is? Shoes. Did a try before you buy from Amazon on these Brooks shoes. Cody loves them, says they're fantastic. I'll have to try them out and see how they are. Mm, they have that new shoe smell. They're uh, kind of glorious. A lot less blue than my current New Balance shoes, but these are wide width, which I love. And uh, I'll be trying these out extensively to see if we love them. Oh, wow, 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 that was close. That is close. Oh, you got your crap. Yeah, you're I mean, I this is my office. No, it's not. It's your turdis. <laughs> no, <it's not. laughs> Wee. 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 you cursive today? Yeah, this is my first wow. time. Wow. There's a lowercase, there's my name. Yep. Lowercase C, uh, R, uh, K, L, uppercase C, and M. Lowercase M, a Y, a D. G and I. Your M has one extra hump on it, but that looks really good. Now you can do your signature. I just got the 28 minute exclusive Patreon video edited. This is my vlog of my day during the day that I got the printer, if that makes sense. I was gonna put a clip in of our dinner from last night because I could, uh, we're having the same thing. This is leftovers, even better the second time through. Pork, hot dogs, sauerkraut, potatoes. New Year's day every day. Clark Mann's back at it again. So yeah, we're trying to take out G-Max uh, Eternatus right now with the Swing Shield Pokemon help. Is that the bad guy up there? Yeah. Holy smokes. That's, that's the G-Max version, and it's literally like a legendary I'm shit. big scared, Clark Mann. No. You know what I'm going to play, right? Yep. <laughs> All right. Oh, they're using moves. Yep. Let's go. Dang, they did big damage. What's actually happening over There's here? There's the guy on the front cover. There, that one with the sword in his hand. That, not that one, that's for the shield game. Are they on your team? Mm-hmm. They're helping us defeat this monster. Boom! That does big damage. He's got a lot of health left. Mm -hmm. Dang. Clark Man Pokemon. Pokemon Sword. 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 I'm fighting against the final guy. 
The final boss of the game. Oh my gosh. You're talking about Leon the Peon. That's him. Mm -hmm. Holy smokes. He has a Charizard that's level 64. I'm gonna win it right here, right now. Charizard, gone. Is that his final guy? Mm -hmm. No way. I beat the champion. No way. <laughs> wow, Clark, man. Colossal. You champ. You champ. My time as champion is over. But what a champion time it has been. Thank you for the greatest battle I've ever had. Here's $15,600 for winning. Wow. True. Wow. Good job, buddy. They're like, psych, here's a bigger challenge coming on. Take down two. The game just turns off. It's like you. It's like you've done it's, it. It's like. It didn't even give you anything. It just gave you a black screen. <laughs> it glitched. It's like. He oh, there you go. He actually, he's holding a Pokeball. How about a rematch, you peasant? There's my mom. <laughs> Congratulations, Clark. You've beaten the unbeatable champion, making you the new champion of the region. You've become the first rate trainer at all rate. I offer you a heartfelt congratulations. You going. have it, and we will let you in right before our eyes. Your champion, Clark! Woo! Woo, 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 woo. Yeah, man. That's but awesome. That's the way you kind of future of a kid like strength with my eyebrow. I sure can't. Let's wait. Let's watch and watch see him. what he can do. Yeah. That's pretty cool, man. Pokemon Sword. They're going to roll credits. Don't press anything. There you go. You rolled credits, Clark. It's one of the only times you've ever done this other than Clone Drone. <laughs> That's cool. Look at that dude. How's it feel? I beat my first Pokemon sword. That's um, great, buddy. What's today? May... 29th. May 29th, 2024, I beat Pokemon sword. You're a champion, Clark, man. You always were, but now you are a Pokemon champion. I can't believe I actually did that. I actually beat the Pokemon game. How do you feel about yourself? Feel proud? Mm-hmm. Accomplished? Time for another run. <laughs>